What's up? It's the Ninja Prodigy back here with another video. So I wasn't lying, we still do have plenty of videos to upload. And this one came from really recently, this most recent Friday. This is going to be a run from Jump Twist Ninja Academy. So every month they have these little mini competitions that you could do. So I decided to attend it and this was a nice speed course. Really test your focus, agility. There's some balance obstacles there to slow you down a little, but this was a nice speed course with a chance to really show off your skills. So this is definitely a speed course. The first one was some swinging objects. And this one was a ring to an ape hold onto an unstable bridge. Again, the key of this course is to go fast for me, so I went for an early dismount. Next obstacle here was the devil steps. You gotta climb up, reach across, then go back down. After that was the not so speed portion of the balance obstacle. So you have some, a little bit of wobbly pegs onto a teeter totter and you had to land that just right and you had to push it down with your leg, which makes it a bit harder because you're going off an unstable surface straight into a couple of other swinging objects and then you try to go to a dismount on the other side. Then it's the obstacle I love to see, the wing nuts. So I decided to just use two swings here and just reach across because I was able to do on those ones and then swing for a really big dismount. That got me an extra point which helped cement my win. So the next obstacle is just some speed balance obstacles. I went straight into that from the wing nuts. Then finally was the mega wall. My shoes have been a little worse of traction on it and you're going to see I missed on my first attempt there. Again, these shoes have not been good with traction lately so I may consider getting new ones but hey I'm in the middle of the run so I just have to get up the wall so second time here I was able to do that with the fastest time in the night so yeah as you can see I went pretty fast despite the miss at the mega wall or the 16 foot wall so not quite the mega wall the first time around I was still able to get the fastest time around with the two extra points and was able to complete the course with the fastest time I got the two extra points from the Mega Wall, which gave me one bonus point, and I got the second bonus point from the Wingnut Dismount, since I decided to go for a super far dismount, which was really far away, instead of like just immediate dismount, that also gave me a second point, so overall, yeah, I got first among the adults again, I did pretty good, and overall, I'm glad I didn't have to chalk between each obstacle, because typically I like to move slower between each obstacle. However, I decided not to need to chalk up until the mega wall. So overall, that saved me a lot of time. So yeah, overall, I did pretty good, I guess. And also, there's still going to be more content to be uploaded. I'm waiting for a couple of more things, but I do have about two videos in store, which I could upload relatively soon. And there are going to be some competitions in November which I could do to upload. So overall, we still have quite a bit going on. See you guys soon.